Howdy, howdy everybody. Welcome back. Thank y'all for being here. Sorry it's loud. There's a lady with the radio on. We're back at this 10 by 25 we bought a month ago and we rented it. It's time to get it out because they're going to charge me again. So, thank y'all for being here. We've already made our money back on this unit, so everything we find from now is great. We're like four feet in the unit, if y'all remember. It's going to be a good one, y'all. I know where we found the grenade launcher. I don't remember. Yeah, the grenade launcher was the two videos ago at the end of it. Um, we have no idea what's in here. We haven't been through any of it. So We left out at 3 a.m. this morning. Currently over here it is now 7. 7 or 8 something. 8 something here. So let's get into it see what we can find. We know it's been a while. Maybe we can be back now. We've had a lot going on, y'all. A lot. Hey, like, share, subscribe. Even when you feel low, you can still go. Even when you feel slow, you can still go. Even when there's no hope, you can still go. I never answered a no, man, I still go. Go, 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 go. It was at this moment that he knew. I screwed up. Go, hustle lot, hustle. So if y'all can remember. We pulled out that arcade game, the video games, and this stuff that was right here at the door. And the grenade launcher, the AR style, airsoft, done sold all that, we're back. So, as far as this stuff goes, we really don't know what's beyond here. Like, yeah. remember we seen the tall saw, and we seen the generator, the generac. But aside from that, y'all. We have no idea. It's a virgin. Terrible. And as y'all can see, let's see, if I zoom in, maybe y'all can see the back wall. You only see a sliver. It is right, well, Coach can say it's in the way, now it's focusing on that right, right there. there, in the middle of your so screen. So, originally, we got uh, white baggie. Originally, we got $400 for this. We rented it for a month. It was $175, I think. So, that's $575, plus the truck rental to come back down here today. So, we're all in this one, probably 800 bucks by the time it's all said and done. And we've already made probably six back. Yeah, five or six. And we still got an arcade machine to sell. So basically everything in here is gravy. So I mean, we're gonna make good on it, so. And y'all, we can't leave personal because we've already rented the unit. Well, they don't want personal, so they ain't get them. Hey, these right here are these Sherwin-Williams. They come in all different kinds of color plates, Sherwin-Williams and Balspar. But people collect these. They're the paint sample or things. Some of them go for $100, $150. Most of them around the $30 to $50 range. So if y'all see these at yard sales or whatever for a buck, pick them up. I mean, that's right there. It's $50. Bucks, easy. Mm hmm So, I mean, we don't find some cool stuff in here, ain't we? We ain't got a whole lot of time, you guys, to dig deep. Yeah, we've been... Acting crazy. So That's we're just going to be skimming work. things for you guys. Paperwork. Here is a motor. plastic pedestal pump motor. Probably still good. I don't, I don't know. Some ball bearings. Just miscellaneous tools down in these. That looks like a plumbing tile uh, Just bucket. miscellaneous right down in these. Plumbing and tile. Here is a thing of caulk. Good lord of money. It's a caulk. Here's a case. A peck multi head. Look at that. What does it say? Pull the styrofoam back down. Uh, it tells you what it is. Crimp yeah, tool. It's for pex piping, like your plumbing piping. That's probably good money. But y'all can squat down and look down into it. And it's just full of tools and such. And plumbing and such. Here's a wagon. Okay. There's no telling what we're going to find. Is it bad to say, honey, I don't know if we can get it all. A hmm? bucket of spikes. You didn't hear me at all, did you? What if we got the train? What if we can't get it all? Why can't we? 
I'm just saying we'll put it on, put it on a truck. Well, it'll fit. You don't have to get packed exactly like it sits in there. She will fit, honey. I promise you, she will fit. Y'all ever tried to put a 25 foot unit in a 26 foot truck? It's hard. Look at this tile saw. And showed it's them already. It's diamond backed, seven inch heavy duty tile saw. And it's on its stand, that wheels. That's a fake book. Earbuds. Emoji keychain. That's gonna be me after today. Cellular device. An old one. A mobile. An old mobile. Some matches. Ooh. And a little blue dinosaur. And your glove has got a hole in it. That's fine. Y'all, it is packed like too deep in here. This Open. is marked kit. Yes, but you about had an avalanche of boxes. What kind of kit? Uh, I don't know. I don't have a knife. You want a screwdriver? Here. Here's a screwdriver. That'll work. Y'all say something about me not being prepared. Yeah, we have a knife. It's just currently in the truck and that woman, is still, that woman is still outside, so it's just kind of awkward. My I do bring them. I just don't always get them out. My rent may have been due here two days ago, so let's hope they don't come down here and try to kick us out because we ain't paid them. Which, I mean, if they do, I guess we'll just pay them. But... Yeah, I don't think it was Kit. It's a fat little chicken. Y'all see him? He ain't got no markings on him. <laughs> but I'm assuming this is all chicken. <laughs> So I'm not going to dig any more of them out or they'll get broke. Like, I'm going to tell you, this thing is jam packed. Okay, so what we need to do, are we going to start going down the middle? Oh, yeah. Or are we going to start on the sides? In the and middle. just Straight like, down the middle. Like, should we do one side and then the other side and then continue or just straight down the middle and then sides? What is that thing? Plastic pedestal. Is that the pump? <gasps> That's the pump. That's it. I don't know. Look, see the picture? What is the pump going? I mean, I don't we'll see. Same, same thing. See? Same thing. Same thing? If it's in there. High hopes there, bud. Okay, so let us load this junk right here at the door out. It's nothing fun to see. This couch and crap. Well, I mean, are we doing that or are we going down the middle? Let's get this crap. Let's get this right here done. I mean, what if we go down the middle and then all this crap? Yeah, then we'll see. The couch if we, has got to go yeah, out at the end. But here's the problem. If we go down the middle, okay, we're going to see everything down to the sides and we're going to lose our motivation. If we get this chunk out, we're still going to be pumped up to see what's back there. Okay, but those. Okay, let's just, let's just, before we do something crazy, like a pedal fan thing. If we get hot, you can get on there and blow me off. I know. All right. This is where we're at, you guys. Quarter of a truck loaded. So that wasn't a refrigerator, that's a freezer. Stand up freezer. And it's an older model, but <laughs> the dude knew what he was doing when he stored it. Like it is clean. He cleaned I mean, it and then left it open. These older ones like this, they're hard to kill. And this right, all this looks like it's been replaced recently, don't it? Is that or he took really good care of it? So. But he left it open, so therefore it won't stink. Right, so let me show so you what we got on the truck. Dude. You gotta come up here. Do I gotta go for a two? Yeah. What's well, the front door? Hang on. Okay. Sorry, it's a little jumpy. Okay, so we got a 6250 maximum watch Generac portable. Um, Generac. If I take you missing? It's not um not seized or anything. I'm pretty sure it'll run, no problem. You may hey. have to clean the carburetor or something. But How do you say that? Tecumson? I don't know. But it's got compression. Um, this box right here is pretty good. Check your glasses, I've seen some. Video games. This is full of... PS2. PS2s. But we have found I mean, signs of PS4. And then look, I opened up this. It's and it's DS. full of DS's. Like, there's some good ones in here, like... Monster Hunter Ultimate 4. Pokemon. Mario, Yoshi. That's Mario, Yoshi's New Island and Paper Mario. And then we got Pokemon. Y'all see that Pokemon? X or whatever it is. 
so that's cool. We got a DS. Which I'm sure that covers down in here. Yeah, we didn't. PlayStation 2, or Super Mario 2, Super Mario Duck Hunt. There's another container we did not open in here. Let's just see if we can lift it. Well, if you do it, you may not get it back in there. That's, All Nintendo yeah, stuff. Yeah, that's the NES stuff, it looks like. So, I mean, this thing is just chock full. I mean, he didn't take very good care of the stuff. Sure didn't, but I mean, it's chock full. I and mean, there's a Converse box here. It's probably got... It. Oh, it's got the NES actually in it, see? Okay, that's good. It at least took time with the older stuff. You might as well set that container behind you on that other container. So you don't stack on top of it. Uh -huh. Mm-hmm. Now that you've opened it and messed it up. Okay, so now we're going to put this up here and we're going to throw stuff over that. And see what we got in here because I don't know. I've seen some stuff that looks cool. There we go. Hang on. Don't get bumpy. Ugh. Like, look at all these boxes, y'all. Which is a good thing. I am grateful he used boxes because they stack a little bit better. Okay, so like this says MB Pictures. But look, you see these red containers? Those are all Milwaukee, right? I don't know. Ain't no walkie red and white. That's a gun safe. Is it? Are we sure? Positive. We got a gun safe. Yeah, but did he leave his guns in it? Judging by what we found, I'm going to say yes. This has got something in it. It's a little like drill bits. Yep. Yeah, that's Milwaukee, honey. I thought red was. Isn't red Milwaukee or Snap on something? We got like these Milwaukee things. pack out bags. I've never seen pack out containers though. It's pretty neat though, ain't it? Look at that. It's just full of stuff. Please. Miscellaneous odds and ends, what we call that in the biz, guys. Randoms. This is Remington. Low velocity powder actuated. Oh, that's a um, thing to shoot these in the concrete. Like a rim set. They go off a 22 charge. So we could have used that when we put our wall in our concrete floor. Because this right here blows the nail in the, into concrete. Well, that's nice. Now we gotta gotta have to dig out and get the gun safe, you yeah. guys. Here's another one. At least he kept his stuff fairly organized. Yeah, that's a gun safe. Is it got a keypad or is it a key? It's like a turn one. A dial. Now we got something to look forward to, honey. Well, that joker ain't getting busted out here. It's getting busted at the store. Right, so we don't commit any felonies. Right. Because if there's a handgun in there and we don't know it's in there and we carry across state lines, we're good. But don't worry, you guys. We got a friend that runs all it for us. Speaking of which, let me just send him a picture. All right, y'all. Let us get some of this stuff moved out. And then we'll show we'll you the... that. If we run across anything cool, we'll figure it out. But that's... well, when we get to that, we'll send you a better picture. I mean, we'll send you a better send y'all a better picture. We'll, we'll show you guys a better visual of it. All right, y'all. We still at it. Y'all check out my jugs. I ain't pulling them out. I'll pull some of them out. There's one of my jugs. Big jugs. So, we found this. Is it in there? Nope. It's not breaking. Quit pulling stuff! Y'all, this thing's empty. Um, I was going to wait and show y'all, but it's empty. Undoubtedly, me and that fella's got the same fingerprints, but it's empty. But well, we no, then we all do because I opened it first. Because now we can get into it and sell it at least. I mean, that's something. This guy wrote like he was in kindergarten. 
K I Y glass. I think mean, so, it's supposed to be a tea like kitchen glass. We don't know what's in any of this stuff, y'all. So maybe the guns are in something else. They're not. They're long gone. Never know. It's one of them butcher box tables. See what I'm saying? Got your little pull-out drawer. Got a spot for your knife so I can stand here and, you know, chop my meat, beat my meat, roll my meat, cook my meat. Pretty much anything you need to do with meat. Or vegetables. You could do vegetables. Couldn't you? Melons. <laughs> can I look in this box? Nope. It's, it's Why do you tape. tape every box you got, guy? Why don't I have a knife? There's a pencil behind you with a drill bit. Oh, there's some keys. Oh, that's pro nope, that's not the key. But we probably need to hang on to those keys in case they fit <laughs> something else. Um, y'all say something about me being unprepared. I don't even care anymore. Wow. Dinosaurs. Wow. I recognize this. Jurassic World? No. I don't know where I recognize them from, but I recognize them. That's a Trojan horse. Okay. Look at that feller. Y'all see him? It's so dark in here. I can't see anything. Okay, well, we know it's toys. God, why don't you holler? Look at that. We can scare Curtis with that. Oh, you're never going to get him back in that box. Jeru. There's cream and dinosaur. She wanted one last night at the store, and Courtney said, No, you ain't getting it. So for $50, you can all play with it once or twice. See, so those not going to get it back in there. And he was a packing wizard. That's why Courtney don't let me take stuff out again. See, that box is not closed. Coffee mugs. There you go, toys. And games. Toy train. This okay, set that over here. That's like glass. Open it up. Look at that. Something raunchy? No, it's too. It's raunchy. Look how dirty it is. Look at it. Plastic. Okay. Uh-oh. What? They painted a cross on that box. Two of them. Uh-oh. Yikes. Box. Some hairs in that. That's gross. Leland. Oh, I know. I get the cross now. The, bo the box has Bibles. Got it. See? It says Bible. Where do you see that? B I B L E. It says B I B B L E. Bibble? B I B. I think B -B -L -E. it's supposed to be. I don't know. Maybe they couldn't spell. Uh-oh, we got a bed in here. There's so many in here, we got cake and cheese. You cut my glove. Can't cut a box. Where's our knife? In a truck. You want me to go get it? Don't rip the box and can't seal it. Again. Look at Amanda's ashes in it. Well, man, it's coming out. That's ridiculous. That's a darn good We're going to have to go get an eye. All right, hold this. So much easier. Let me pull out the knife. We really haven't been going through anything since we've not been filming. So we didn't feel the need to have the... Man, they take me to do I really think it's his nana. box with the and then this is just a box of paper with crosses on it. 
They stole this Bible from a motel and packed it better than they have packed any dish I have found. Why don't you pack it for me? It's just Bibles are wrapped up. Can I catch something else? That one's brand new. I wrapped it though and packed it like a I mean, look at all this paper. Okay, what was the other one? Games. Stay that joker. I put 15 layers of tape on. And all this paper again. I hope everything's not packed like this. Okay, this could be good. It's an ideal train. I know ideal dolls do good. And it works. Look at that. Wow, she about took off out of the box. That thing's gonna go fast. That's all that's in here is train. That could be worth good money, couldn't it? Y'all let me know in the comments if that's worth good money. It'll probably still be in this box by the time y'all see this. And I'll probably lose it. Okay, honey. Let's load up this stuff and we'll come back to them if we find anything. Okie dokie. We've come to a couple conclusions here, fellas. Fella These gloves say for surgical use. Medical use. Medical use. But every time the wind blows, they tear. So you would definitely get AIDS if you wore these in the medical field. AIDS or gonherpesyphilitis. There's all kinds of crap, bad crap out there that'll get you. And these tear so easy. We, we didn't bring our other gloves. I bet we went through a hundred pairs. We didn't go quite through um, that many. There's only a hundred pair in the box. Like they just bust. So what else are there? Oh, and we usually show up and we don't have enough water or anything like that, you know, because we drink it all. So Courtney said, I'm going to pack us a cooler full of water. So she thought, okay, let's freeze all of our water. I didn't and freeze all it, of it. And put it, except for one bottle, <laughs> and put it into a cooler. And now we have no. But there's water. no cooler in ice. I mean, there's no ice in the cooler thing. It was just Except the for the ten-pound blocks of ice she put in there. Hey, they were slowly melting. So now all of our water is frozen. No, y'all, y'all, he's over exaggerating. Told They're bottle. literally laying in okay, the parking lot. Okay, but your bottle was not frozen. My bottles are frozen. There was one bottle not frozen. And I gave it to him to be nice. And every other bottle is frozen, and we got it laying in the parking lot, thawing because we're about to die. <laughs> So here's where we're at. I can see right through your ear. Through it? All the way through it? <laughs> like, in, <laughs> like in your ear. Good way when you God. do that. I don't know. I'm weird. No brain. Just right through it. So we've got the hair. We got. We just put a washer on. There's a dryer. There's a stackable. And then all this furniture. And we need our second wind, y'all. We've been out the game for about <laughs> Two three weeks. weeks. Uh, longer than that. Four weeks. And uh, it's about to kill me. If you don't do this often, it'll wear you out. So. Ask us how we know. We left out at 3 a.m. We got up. It's now 11, 17, we left, Well, we left about 4, we'll say, what, 4, 10, 4, 15 4, by the time we got gas and everything. So, it's 11, 17 Georgia time, 10, 17 Alabama time. So, we've been. Six hours. It's been a long time. I don't even know how long it is. I'm so tired. I don't know either. I'm six hours. And Ted puck, pucked. <laughs> Ted packed like a. Ted packed horribly. 
Ted packed, packed horribly. Y'all understand. Okay. That was not what I was expecting in the first blood bag. Ted packed pitiful. Historic North Cross Art Splash and Wine Festival. Wow. What I've always wanted. My dad just put all his crap in here. What's the harness? I ain't even pulling that out because I'm going to have to put it back in there and I don't want to do all that. Every, every box is so heavy. Watch the hand truck seem stacked on them. I guess you're still on the truck. Oh boy, catheters. <laughs> <laughs> That's what you first wanted to pull out. And some atomic biscuits. First place. What's the comic biscuit? I'm assuming it has something to do with catheters. And we got a bunch of cassette tapes. Can y'all see them? I'm not pulling these out. Yeah, he's holding the catheter. Holding the catheter with my mouth. It's so random. We'll close it back up right. No, like right ah. across the box. Kitchen glass, we don't want that one. I think it's what you're going to get. I think that's a microwave. You can't climb. You have to wait till we move some boxes. You're gonna stab yourself. Oh God, here it goes. It's just glassware, it's fine. That junk don't sell no way. We lost the knife. What was it? Oh, Six plus thirds? It says Xmas on top. Let's go to our stairs. Yeah, let's go pull them stairs over. My Colton's struggling to catch the knife he dropped. It's probably Christmas. It says Christmas, but it's probably Christmas. Looks like AARP papers. Oh my gosh. These tape there. There was no need for that. The same stencil is on the. I don't know who that is. The Dale in the box. We're getting there, honey. Wild of spirit. No. Oh, 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 I see something. Gucci. No, it's picture album. Yeah, it's not. first underwater camera photos we have them well there's some adidas Eight. and we got one adida wow yeah, one of them It says bath stuff open. Gladly. It smells like soap. I love soap. It smells like a bar of soap. Oh, it smells so clean. Oh, look! Wow. It's 
some gloves. Jesus was listening. He answered me. Answered my prayers. Yeah. No. One set. <laughs> yeah. Wow. <laughs> Proactive. Benadryl. Brasso. There's that dial I smell. Alley, alien. Oh, Klein. <laughs> 12. <laughs> Nana. Here's Nana. What was his fascination with empty boxes? There's so many of them. Hey, we're trying to pick all that up. Meth kit. Nana's costume jewelry. Hey, some of his costume jewelry, though, is big bucks. I ain't got time to look at it. We will eventually. So this was Nana's sewing container. Sewing stuff. I can see it sewing stuff. Oh, Nana's jewelry. Nana didn't have her ears pierced. And Nana didn't have not no money. Gotta get better stuff. Uh, so ah, just holler at it. <laughs> Roar! There's two sets of horns. Right next to it's another set of horns. Y'all, Courtney seen that set. You gonna have to fix that. <laughs> he said, "Like I'm fixing that." You so, really could, pretty easy look. Boom. You're still missing a piece at top. We're all missing a few pieces, honey. Hmm. I mean, it's old. I understand that. All right. Well, if I fix that, you got to recover this cookie. I ain't written, no, because we're all like it. And somebody took a knife straight down that thing. Look at that slice right down the middle. That Joker did not like. What if they're full of cash? Alrighty guys and gals, so we are back from the last storage unit y'all would have seen where we were loading and moving all that crusty old crap. crap. <laughs> Crap's a good word for it. But luckily this morning we were back here in the back pricing that crusty old crap and some friends dropped by. And Go we, ahead. <laughs> <laughs> and we asked if they needed some help. Yeah, so we fixed to put them to work. They traveled all the way from Lonnie's neck of the woods. If y'all know shed flips, garage flips used to be um, Lonnie and Candace. So they're down from around Baton Rouge, Denham. Hey, Denham so. Springs. Denham Springs. Denham yeah. Springs. Bonnie so, and Mike. Miss Bonnie <laughs> and Mike. Mike yeah. didn't want to be in the video, but he's in the video. But they're they're just as sweet as or sweeter in person than. They called us on a bad day. I'm wore out. Oh, y'all don't y'all don't look wore out at all. Y'all been so kind, so kind. Enjoy your videos. Oh, and well, thank y'all so let, much. Let, so they can attest. They look bigger on camera. <laughs> and for two, is this back room a wreck? Is it a wreck? Would you consider it a wreck? Oh, uh, looks like a lot of fun to me. I don't know. It's a lot of dirty, dirty fun. Yeah. Doesn't look like anything I'd so, like to tackle. I can tell this you is that unit y'all just watched. We just basically unloaded it wow. into here and then go through one anything. Mm -hmm. Yes, one wow. unit. Well, I would be like, whoa, overwhelmed. Yeah, minus the, the junk like my energy drink <laughs> and the Dawn and 
recording. Yeah. Right, clean it. But we've got it in here now. Now we just got to go through it and price it. And yeah, this was a 10 by 25. Where do y'all put it? Wow. Right here. Y'all just, where do you sort at? Right, right here. here. Right here. In the video. In the video. This is my trash pile. <laughs> And then we're just putting it, well, usually we got the table cleaned off and we can do that, but yeah. I have found it is impossible to keep any kind of organization in here. You and that's what it. makes it fun. Well, you can't, I mean, because like I'm bad about, like if I need something, I pick it up and I take it over here and I put it down and that's where it stays until I need it again. And by that time I've put 15 other things down on top of it. Like the, what is it, the price gun? Yeah. yeah. We just yeah. This is it. one storage unit. How big was it? Like a uh, 20 10, by 30? or? Uh, it was a 10 by 25. Mm -hmm. Must have been. It was floor to ceiling, yeah. Y'all so take the, video of that. This is the same unit y'all would have seen in the last video where I got the grenade launcher. Okay, yeah. I think I remember that one. At the end yes. of it, I pulled out a grenade launcher when we went back to get it. So we finally just went back to get it because there was no time. Oh, I bet y'all sleep good at night. If Courtney didn't wake me up at 4 o'clock in the morning... Oh my goodness. <laughs> I didn't really wake you up. Crimson woke you up. <laughs> Alright y'all. So, back to getting what we were getting at. So, this is that unit, you know, we just brought in. We're really going to start digging into it, going through it, and show y'all some stuff. I'm more slap out. Like, my energy, like, I could go to sleep right now. I've been up since 4. I thought you got up at 4.20. I'm just so Y'all like my new shoes? Check these out. <coughs> you had to, yep. Hang on, you're blending in with the stuff. There. That's because they're sea camo. See that white leg? It kind of matches our shirts. Suck in my belly. Pose. So, these are the Shark Week Walmart Crocs. Fourteen ninety. No. Twelve. Ninety-six. Twelve ninety-something. Get y'all a pair. They're awesome. Awesome stuff. So, mainly right here what we got is a crap load of metal of metal and like a engineered six foot drill bit that's been taped together. That has been taped together. So, essentially what we got is a mess on our hands. A straight up mess because look, we don't know where to go. We're out of space. We're literally, this is my trash pile. This is my keep pile. And we're just running through it. I mean, just as we go. Oh, we can show them. They done seen that, didn't they? The what? video game bucket. I don't know. I don't know either. I think they have. I think we showed it. It's right here. But I think we showed it in the previous clip. Do y'all want to see my python? I'm going to shut it. Do y'all want to see my python? Buy it all then, Flossy. So, if y'all hear anybody, we're literally right at the door. See, right at the door. And there's people in there, and I heard them say we're buying it. So, uh, let us get through this bit of tools because it's really nothing interesting for y'all. I mean, if y'all want to see like a 20 inch granite vanity top side splash it's black i'll show it to you <laughs> but <laughs> <laughs> i mean a lot of our work is not oh that's that's garbage unless you want some apple cider or it's not grand at all like extra virgin you know you kind of have to pick and choose what i show you in the video um so i think we just overwhelmed our viewers so i completely overwhelmed myself actually so this kind of stuff right here um it's like used paints spray paint and like stuff. look there's a whole crate of it and you find this kind of stuff in every unit and whether it's half full or full like that one's half that one's probably full you can still sell the devil out of this stuff like a lot of people will just throw it away which is crazy we to sell it just for a cheaper price than what like the, the half a can i'll be able to get like a buck 99 on it and like the fuller can i could probably get 3.99 or two well, it's a bigger can. It's a bigger can. Than so I mean, I'm gonna price that one a two ninety nine, and we're going. We sell used paint, y'all. Even in. Oh, I done put them out. She done put them out. The gallon. Even in the gallon, y'all. Pop it open. Make sure it looks good. You know, and it's not separated too bad. Give it a little shake, it shake or a stir. Shh. Or don't open them and just price it. But we do that, and it sells 
fast. Like it's one of our faster sellers used stuff like this. And you can do it with anything. Cleaners, like. That's extra virgin bottle. Probably wouldn't do it with that one. That one probably needs to go in the garbage. Here. How do you become extra virgin? I don't know. This one's <laughs> new. You can sell um, it. Comet, we can sell Comet. The EVOO. I mean, probably chunk that. If it's open food, get rid of it. I, I would just put it back in the bucket so it don't leak. We're going to take that home and make a slip inside. Ooh. Um, You're not going to press it? So, Apple cider vinegar. Like that right there. That, look at that right there. Would you look at that? I'll tell you right there. Right I there. hate the smell of That right vinegar. there is brand new, son. I'm going to tell you that right there is brand new. We'll probably get what? Expiration? Still in date for another year, so I mean, we probably get what? Is buck, it really? I didn't look. Buck 99 for some used vinegar. It's new. New vinegar. So I mean, don't, don't sleep on vinegar. <laughs> Did okay. you press the comment? You were telling me you could sell oh, new stuff? Yeah, new stuff. Just boom. What'd you press it for? $1.99. How much is it at the stove? I don't know. If it's too high, it won't sell. And then you just mark it down. But or really... somebody says, hey, I can go buy it at the store for such and such price. Well, yeah, Curtis, one time we had a pan here and it was marked for 79 cents. Lady come, they couldn't make out the price of it. And she said, how much is this? Does it say like $7.99 or something? Curtis said, yeah, it's $7.99. She said, we can buy this same thing for a buck fifty at Walmart. And Curtis like, well, go buy it at Walmart then. And then they got to looking at 79 cents. Yeah, they could buy it at Walmart. They weren't lying. Oh, check this out, though. This right here is cool. This is a brass stove. <laughs> is it a stove or is it? I don't know what it is. Could be an urn for all I. Not an urn. Does it open? Does it open? It looks like it's separated right there. Oh, it opens. I was gonna say this is like a spittoon, but then it would run down the leg. I really, I really do not believe that's supposed to open. Because right? there is no latch on it to close it now. That would have been an awesome antique stool. <laughs> um, sometimes you just got to figure it out if you don't know what it is. So what we're going to do now is we're going to glue that back on there. And we're going to sell it. We'll just do, dab some super glue around it. We'll super glue and brass hold together. I don't know. We're going to find out. Do you any super glue? Uh, somewhere. We'll just set this over here for another time. <laughs> um, just a lot of tools, y'all. A lot of tools. Now, how we sell our tools, okay? I think this is important because units have tools in them. So we got a bin up front, single screwdrivers and stuff that ain't nothing. They're all dollar twenty-five each. We throw it in the bin. It's up near the register. They pull it out, buy it for a buck twenty-five. Now, if it's something unique. Hence this. These are some um, Vice Grip actual brands, and they are the U. I guess what they'd call them. C clamp or O clamp or I don't know. She said O clamp. Well, man, it's, it's no. what, whatever these Vice Grips things are. So these type things we'll price them separately. Probably get four, three ninety nine to four ninety nine on these. Throw them on the shelf. If we got a bunch of stuff and it's already in a toolbox, generally I just sell the whole toolbox as one, one thing. So tools are fairly easy. Courtney hates them, but they sell. I've got to go to the bathroom. Okay, so we got these Tony Llamas. Found them. Check these puppies out. They are brand new. They are size 13D. And big feet. You know what to say about people with big feet? They trip often? I guess they would, but no. They wear big boots. I wonder if him would fit me. I don't know, all boots are different. It's like butterflies. Okay, so we got them. Let's just chunk Um, I did buy a really good video game score yesterday in a private deal. Do we need to turn Rev off or are we just gonna leave Rev on? Should I cut Rev off? Rev, you're on my TV. No, we'll just leave. We'll just give a shout out to Rev. Where's your mouth? 
You can't pause this TV? Oh, I just changed it to the news. Uh-oh. You have a great day. So, yesterday a buddy of mine brought me this again. Check this trunk. <laughs> Check this trunk out. Zelda. Uh, Super Mario Bros. 3. Super Mario Bros. 1. Another Zelda. And it's got Mario on top. A little trunk. It's pretty sick. So, bought this whole thing from him for three feet. Just look at the glory in here, y'all. So, that's um, Flying Dragon, Double Dragon. A lot of these right here aren't very good. These ones, you know, 10 bucks a piece. But then we get into, we got like Pokemon Yellow, Gold, Pikachu. Uh, a lot of the Dragon Warriors, Breath of Fire 4, Dragon Warrior, Mega Mans. I mean, we got N64 stuff, Mario Kart, Super Smash Bros, Pokemon White. But listen, look, look. What? It's okay. But he thinks he's got it, so he may bring it back to me. But I mean, look down in here. It is just jam packed, y'all. There's Game Boy. There's yeah, there's um, where they there's Game Boy Advance. This thing is just full of odds and ends. There's a color. There's a 3DS in here. Somewhere. But look. We got like this. Whole coloring book. Somebody colored the absolute and painted the dickens out of this thing. But it's still cool. Still cool. Oh. We got like Kirby. But they're all empty. Where's that Super Nintendo Kirby? Oh, we got RPG Super Mario. There's a the 3DS. So this trunk was better than the whole unit we just bought. As far as cool stuff goes. Well, wasn't it, Curtis? Alrighty, y'all. So we were standing here going through this box right here, and I pulled out this thing. Thank this. And it was full of junk. We emptied it out here to sort through it. That way we don't get poked by any needles. And Courtney pulled out a lot of gift cards. So yesterday, this is still the same unit. We were going through a golf bag and we found this gift card. It's got $50 on it, y'all, for Longhorn, Olive Garden, Cheddar's, Yard House, Bahama Breeze. Some that's not around here. Seasons 22, whatever that is. We only got Olive Garden and Longhorn close, but $50. So we just found this whole clip while ago, so I apologize y'all. But then we started, so we found these. We got a Walmart gift card, Olive Garden gift card, and then there's this Cheesecake Factory gift card. And this Cheesecake Factory gift card was here and it says $100. And then it was wrapped up and here's the gift card and this screenshot also says 100 bones. Well, it don't say bones, but it says $100. So, we called the Olive Garden a while ago, but the camera did not save it. It's been giving me a fit, y'all. 30, wasn't 30? Mm -hmm. $30 on this. So now we're going to Olive Garden. So, take the whole family. We got $80 in gift card. So, let's call this one 1 537 5503. Don't give them the pen now. <laughs> So Welcome people don't to use Walmart it. <laughs> to hear instructions in English, press one. But if we have... Please remember for security purposes, our anchors cannot provide balance information. They can't provide balance information. <phone rings> hear me? Why are you calling somebody? To return your gift card balance or transaction history, press one. They just if they were calling you back. Before we begin, please look at the back of your card. 
If you see a silver scratch off area, scratch off now to see your card number and pen. Your card number, if the person is correct, press 1. If this is not correct, please enter your pen now. Your pin is the four digits of the balance remaining on your gift card is two dollars and forty nine cents. Hey, there's still a balance two dollars and forty nine cents. Two dollars. Two dollars and forty nine cents. Buy us a Coca Cola. Or cram some M Ms. Okay, which one? Okay, now the Big Daddy, the Cheesecake Factory for a hundred bones. Hey, anything one, on that eight, is an improvement. Eight, eight, eight. Welcome to the Cheesecake Factory gift card hotline. But I we don't even have one of these now. Well, we have to grab it and go get a unit. To further process your call, have your gift card number I'll ready and enter the three-digit code you will hear next. Your it's code is six. one six two. Please enter the code now. If you are calling regarding the balance of a card issued in Canada, please press zero now. How do I Otherwise, know? to receive the balance of your U.S. gift card, press one. To speak with a gift card. Okay, Please nice. enter the 16 digit gift card number followed by the pound sign. Please wait while we process your request. The balance remaining on your card is $100. Oh. Again, the remaining Snap. balance is $100. Daddy retiring, son. I'm out. Y'all, we just found $100. $82. $150. How much was on? $30. You got $180. $180. $2.49. Some, and gift cards, y'all. And that's just in the first... And we don't even season. have a cheesecake factory. I told you we'd take a cooler to Atlanta next time we get a unit. What do they sell? Cheesecake? Yes. Burgers? I don't know, I don't know what else they sell. Mm -mm. I don't know, but let's just... Let's okay, y'all. Daddy is out of the, the... I mean, I'm excited now. Can you imagine whatever... He, did, he was not a fan of gift cards, I can tell you that. I mean, why wouldn't he be? So basically, we got nothing in this unit except our truck costs. Um, because we done made it back on the last What's that one. little thing right there? Money? Gift cards? More gift cards? I don't know. No. Junk. But that doesn't mean we won't find more gift cards. There's a big bass. Keep it. You can give it to Cram. Put it on the refrigerator. Band-Aid? That's what it is. So, I'm pretty stoked. Little, that Here. Maybe it's a little tray. Okay, so not bad. Not bad. You know, you cream the bath. Yeah, I'll set it over here. What's wrong with it? Ain't got no air in it. So we having grandmother ain't got no it's blowing cold on one side, hot on the other. I checked all the blend door actuators. I manually turned it everything I know to do. Um, I think it's a little more freon. Because by the time the, the freon gets across the bulls and all this. From what I've read anyway. But, it says it's full. But you can't really go off these crappy juices. We're either going to blow it up or kill it. One of the two. Gotta wait on that compressor to kick on. See y'all look. That compressor on was sitting at 30 yesterday. I had it up to almost 40. And when the compressor kicks on, it should run up to about 50. I got that stuff you can put in it. It says stop leak or something that goes in your 
I ain't gonna clean it. Only about that clean. What's wrong with it? Do we need to go to Walmart? I say before you put any more in it, we just go to Walmart and buy that stuff. You go to my game, ain't working. Well, this side right here is... a degree warmer. Alright y'all, so I'm pretty sure we got a free on link. Not a bad one, but it's there. So, figure that out later. Happy Father's Day to all of you fathers. Today's Father's Day. It is currently, what time is it? Early. 7.10 a.m. Miss Courtney got me up at 4 to come over here and work. I did not. She said payback is, uh, uh, so, I mean, you gotta work. What else am I gonna do, die? relax so we've got a lot of this out we went through yesterday got all the trash took out been priced and stayed uh, we're gonna keep on this morning just we got eat, a little hole eating away at it y'all i say eat elephant one bite at a time ain't it? Mm -hmm. i gotta go look at some furniture to purchase at 9 30 9 30 um some furniture down the road so we'll go check that out see what they got but i'm gonna end this video now to Get it edited and uploaded by tonight. Yeah, it's on there. So, thank y'all all for watching. We love you all. And um, please like, share, subscribe. Share it wherever you can share it. See y'all. Ring my bell. We call them. Ding, ding, ding.